you all traders welcome to susan fx one channel in this video i want to teach you a very good powerful strong four hour trading strategy which is good for you if you trade intraday swing trading whatever day trading you do you can use this powerful setup this is a very good system for you who have problem for getting to the market struggling you don't know when to get in you are always losing trades you get confused okay so listen up and do it practice it for a couple of hours and see what you see okay let's begin for the start i just want to tell you what we have on the chart so you can use it if you don't have these two things it will be hard for you to understand this trading setup first thing which is very important is this moving average colored by the yellow color here this is a nine exponential close moving average right this is very important number two is this indicator right here the name is half trend okay this is the name of the indicator it's all the colors you can just put these two to none and uh, you can keep the rest input i just put it to three that's it and here is the place you can download this half trend i will put the link for you don't worry just focus and listen up to the rest of the show okay let's jump to the chart and see what's going on this is the chart and what is the rules the rules are extreme simple but you have to have a fate on what you are doing we are talking about the candles which are four hour long you know if you pull the trigger for buy now you have to wait four hour or eight hour to see what's going on okay let's have a look at this area price gets bearish with these black candles comes under the nine ema close here or half trend getting changed color from blue to red this area is your entry for sell okay you sell because the four hour candle comes under the nine moving average and close this is your entry reason okay stop loss you can use the atr to uh, count how much you have to uh, put your stop loss let me show you here i have um, i have my atr but the pips is 11 for example there and um, if we enter here so we have to put our stop loss two gang atr or three gang atr okay so if we count it from here it's about 22 is in in the top of this four hour candle you can put your stop loss you shouldn't put your stop loss in these areas you have to put it twice atr and when you put your stop loss 22 pips above in this area you have to have a good risk management if you do one standard lot if the price go against you it will cost you 220 dollars loss all right okay but if you do micro 0 0.01 times 22 peps it will be something around 10 peps per pip so it's about 2.2 dollars .2 loss for you if you do micro if you do mini lot 0.1 22 pips 22 dollars is at risk so you have to be be aware of your risk management let's go on and when you get in here as long as your four hour candle is under nine just stay just stay all right if you want to if you get tired just get out all right but here price you open your computer you you looking at the chart you see a situation uh, like this you are somewhere around here and when you look at the chart you are in this position i will ask you now do you buy or do you sell one two three we do nothing here nothing nada right see we move we move we move we move boom 
what the hell happened here? See here. In this case, this is hot. I want to get in. All right. Let's see. We get in, we put our stop loss somewhere, and then we go shopping. And then our price just respect. Respect. Actually, we have to get out somewhere around here in this area. Okay. You can get out here, here. Okay. The size you get is very nice. It's phenomenal. See here. And then price go down, gets back up again. You get in. All right. This is how it is. And uh, right now, I can show you. I'm standing in NSD USD for our chart. Okay. What do we have here? We have our nine um exponential moving average here price is over it closed okay only thing i think is a buy and i bought it right here my half trend is all blue and one more thing this half trend can very nice work like your exit indicator if you enter here you see the price getting over the nine right here you get in and then you can get out as soon as you see a red arrow okay or a red color here but you have to adjust it to your taste i put the numbers to three for half trend that's what i like right so let me show you another scenario here this is audnsd look here i got to the trade for a sell here right why i did that there was two reasons one price was under the nine ema check color was red check this last strong support area was broken so i sold that was my reason on this one let's move on i can show you a couple of trades here i have what's going on i showed you this one this one i showed you euro j let's have a look at euro j euro j is here look what's going on here this is not magic this is a trading setup if you don't have any trading strategy you cannot win the market you cannot win any money okay you cannot just get in blindly this market is tough is difficult you have to learn it by doing all right open a demo account practice 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 okay see here price is above the nine it's not closed yet but i got in here half trend is red i got into the trade because it cut it through all right you can just wait for this candle to be closed totally and get the next one sometimes i'm just impatient and i can't and i don't like to wait so i just do it all right so i'm in this trade for a buy and uh here in this area very nice four hour support zone as you can see here price getting over shouting that i'm tired of this selling now i want to take over the market and buyers are in the market it's obvious and it's visible all right so i'm just buying here and i can just leave this trade for a couple of hours maybe a day and then look at it one more time because this trading setup is so powerful doesn't need at you sit up in front of the computer at all you know but if you like to sit in the front of the computer all the day it's your choice i like to make a trade that is very strong and if i want to shut down my computer and go out i can do that this trading setup let me do that all right so um i told you very nice strong support zone here price over the nine ema and half a trend is flat um another thing you have to spot your strong next resistance area which is here i can expect the price to come to this area and maybe break through or reverse back all right these assumptions you have to have don't think unreal and say okay this price go here all right no it's not like this all right so let's have a look at the next one which one was that uh this is euro j let me see euro j euro j is here i have three trade here euro usd is right here I usually do not trade euro usd because this pair it's very unpredictable and everybody looking at this pair you know for past couple of hours past couple of minutes this price here was just either zero to 50 cents and then back to the zero but the setup is a good example to show you that i am in the buy 
price is under the nine and it is unsecure. It's just a good example that you can see as long as this price is not above the nine, there is not momentum in it. So when the price gets above the nine, if it does, so it is momentum on that pair. Remember that, right? So this price here, go down, go up, go down, go up, no problem. Because my setup tells me, leave it there, don't think about it. Either I will go up or, or you just lose your trade. So I know that I am in the right direction. This is the most important thing. This direction for four hours is to the downside. Okay, but right here, something is happening that show me that the counter trend is on. That's why I'm on this trade, all right? And um, I don't think that I have um, another trade here. Yes, I have this last one, Euro AUD. Let's have a look at it. This Euro AUD is um, like this. Price is above the nine. Price is above the half trend. But there is not much momentum right now in this price. Just standing here goes two pips high, three pips down, two pips high. But this will eventually, eventually explode to the upside. This is my expectation. What we have learned, look for sell only if your price is in four hourly candle under the nine, under the half trend, right? And look for a buy if the price in four hourly candle above the nine, above the the half trend indicator right this is it folks i hope you like this strategy it's easy it's practical you can use it try to focus on it and do some test on it you will get the result right if you're not subscribed to my channel subscribe please hit the like button have a nice day bye